guys um i thought i'd give you an update i have uh kind of created more ocs and then i thought i would give you an update on what so i have so far in the sketchbook um if you follow me on instagram you've probably seen quite a few of these pictures if not this will all be new to you but i thought i'd give you an update i don't have much in here but i've been sketching every day sometimes one to two sketches sometimes i sketch like five pages once um, and all of that, but, so, the first page is nothing really special, it just says, um, this book belongs to me, uh, Kirsten Tuzna, don't touch, and then I put the month I started it in the year, just in case I don't finish it by the end of the year, although I think I will. Um, this first page was kind of something from Miss Venomous Cupcakes, one of her streams, uh, we came up with a vegan vampire. Well, I decided to redo Garlic, the Vampire Hunter. Um, this is just uh, me messing around with landscape. And then this is just me trying to figure out body form. Sorry about the lighting. I know it kind of sucks. Um, this is one of my OCs, Ty Pennyworth. I just decided to draw it that way. And then this is Clive and Maisie. Um, I ended up kind of, you know putting them together I was working on kissing stuff um this is from me listening to Melanie Martinez it says I may be mad but all the best people are and then I was watching uh Hannibal with Hannibal Lecter so I just did a little sketch of that um this is my teddy bear Buffy the Nightmare Slayer I did not name him he was something I got for Valentine's Day, and I didn't put it on the foot, but it says you are loved. Um, this one is just me trying to do still life, I'm guessing. Yeah, just some still life. Um, this is a quick pen sketch of k Rux, one of my OCs, and then I redid Luna, uh, the mother of Dove. Uh, here I was figuring out how to draw hands and lips, and then this is just a quick five-minute sketch I did at work. Um, I don't know why, but I had funerals on the brain. Don't know why. Um, here's Ashton, one of my newest OCs. He's a, he's a gentleman zombie. As you can tell, the zombie, and then he has two different color eyes. And then this one I did last night, I was working on muscles. Doesn't look the greatest, but I think I got the concept of it down. Um, he's not really a character, it's just something I made, and it's like, oh, he looks like Captain America. So that is the end of this book. Um, I was going to give you guys an update on my OCs. As you can tell, I've kind of uh, color-coded them by generation. Um, and right now this is what I got for family trees. They're kind of all interconnected and it's kind of funky, but it works for me. Um, so the orange stickers are first generation, pink or second generation, and yellow is third generation. Um, I have 23 OCs now with, including Ashton. Um, I can give you all of their names because, yeah, it's kind of confusing considering it's like, wait, you just had 15. Now you have 23. What's going on here? And I've also started filling out some, like, information about them. And I wrote as a note to myself, uh, all ages are at the time of the character's main story. So that means their ages will be changing and such. Um, you guys know of Maisie and AJ and Clive. Uh, Domix, he is third generation. Uh, Clive, Maisie, and AJ are all second generation. Uh, Domix's brother, Lamech, is third generation. Dove is second generation. Chow, who I actually made to be Dove's niece, is third generation. And then Kish is actually Dove's half brother. He's second generation. Ty is, um, well, I just made his family, technically. Uh, he's the half-brother of Michael and Talon. 
who are twins and they share the same mother, not the same father. So he's second generation and is the love interest of Dove. Um, and then there's K-Rox. Uh, I just made him third generation since Domix is third generation. And then we have Michael and Talum, who are twins. Uh, they're the children of Danica, who is first generation, and Sean, who is first generation. Um, Ty is the son of Danica, but he has a different dad. Uh, technically, Ty is the oldest out of all three kids because... He was born first, but then her husband died, and then she met Sean. And then we just get to the impromptu page. And then there's Ryan. Uh, he's the father of AJ and Maisie. Their mother is Melody. Um, and then we have Mauk, who is the husband of Talum. So he's second generation. And then we have Rex Pennyworth. He is the father of Ty. He ends up dying, though. And then we have the father of Dove and Kish, uh, Marks. Marks Picard. And then Kish's mother is Sarah's. And then Dove's mother is Luna. Uh, Dove was actually born out of wedlock. That's why there's different mothers involved. Um, then Akemi is actually the wife of Kish, so she's second generation, and is the mother of Chow. Um, and then we have Ashton, the gentleman zombie. Um, he's technically first generation because he's going to be there for all of the stories, but um, for a few of my characters, they're... I don't want to say that they're LGB... Am I saying it right? LGBT characters, um, that would be Domix and Michael and AJ and Ashton. Um, but AJ and Michael end up getting together at some point and then Ashton and Domix because, I mean, come on, zombies, he's pretty hot for a zombie, if you ask me. But that's all the updates I have. Um, I will be sure to start giving you guys more updates. I'm not sure... I'm going to be doing any more videos this week due to having to work a lot. Um, my work schedule is getting kind of crazy now. But yeah, so there's one final look at the whole mess of a family tree. Yeah, I'm going to probably do a different one and kind of clean it up a little bit. But that's all I got so far for you guys. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Um... If you want to follow me on Instagram, it's just at weird girl, that weird girl underscore 16. Um, I don't have a Facebook page, don't have a Twitter, but make sure you like this video and subscribe. See you guys later.